Hello, my name is Kevin Robinson. I'm with Tartar Farm and Ranch based out of Dunville, Kentucky. Um, Bill, we have a our new catalog here. It's also available on our website. You can search under Tartar Gate or Tartar Farm and Ranch. This is downloadable from our website so you can view everything in it. We're also Facebook and Twitter associated so you can keep track of new products and what we have transpiring there. We're official sponsor of the FFA and working with the World Equestrian Games. Tartar Farm and Ranch is a third generation family owned company based in South Central Kentucky. Also have with a plant in Corrine, Utah. We're full line manufacturer of some 800 items. We just introduced another 50 this spring. These items are basic to all segments of agriculture from light horsepower implements all the way through to basic gate and corral panel needs, dog kennels, and ATV accessories. We have a proprietary system of taking care of coating our products. Gates and corral panels are all e-coated. This e-coating consists of an eight stage process of washing, etching, and preparing the metal, and then having a waterborne poly-based pigment baked onto the enamel this coats inside the tube as well as around all welds and all joints where powder coat has a hard time reaching. We also offer a superior coating called powder over e-coat which entails adding another color to that e-coat base and then you have a very high abrasion resistant product with an eye appealing color. This can all be found both on our catalog our paper copy or the online version and it describes how the layering process as well as our paint system works. We have a wide product line. Some people have seen it uh, marketed by Hunter Specialties. We now have it solely under our name. We're bringing items out that includes a tiller, a flip over disc, as well as a high quality heavier item in the disc and ground breaking market. So that will work both for if the, the small time uh, doing a little bit of lawn repair or if they're into putting in deer food plots, which are being real popular. We've got several dealers that have picked those up in the past couple of years and they're using this rental equipment. Absolutely. Uh, which that, has been a big item lately. This mobile equipment package, was that was the original intent for it. Either someone going to do their own food plot and travel some distance or a location that might rent it. So it's a very good item. Everything having a place on the trailer and multiple attachment points is a, makes it very friendly to renting out if you're a retailer. So that comes trailer Tra and everything? Trailer and all three pieces. So roughly a $4,000 item dealer cost. That's a special built trailer prepared to handle these items. The, di the heavy disc with cultipacker on it, spreader, and a chain hara for dragging in the seed. Everything ready to go. That way, someone that owns that as a private person can hook to it, put their seed and their ATV in the back of their truck, or they can uh, rearrange product on here as they need to, carry their seed and water right there on the trailer as well. Now, would that also be a uh, would that be uh, could also be pulled with a gator as well as an ATV? It could. I have actually um, we don't want the disc on the highway, but the trailer itself, essentially anything. Um, the the it's not is it a pin hitch or is it a, a ball hitch? It's a ball hitch. It's a ball hitch. Uh, so it's it's actually a road rated trailer. Um, roughly the weight on it's about it's showing twenty three hundred pound loaded. Okay. So all but all the it's a ball hitch on the trailer, but then on the uh, equipment's all uh, it's all pinned on on all the equipment. No, I take it back. I thought it. I, I apologize. All the implements are ball hitch as well. Oh, okay. Well, a, a person can put a ball hitch on the back of their gator or anything, so they'd be all set. Do you and happen to know what size ball that is? Off? So an inch and seven eighths on the implements, two inch on the trailer. Okay. Um, so everything there fits the wide range of the market. I've actually used a Kubota RTV 900, pulling the disc with the Cultipacker on it, uh, breaking August red clay in Georgia. So. It does a pretty good job breaking that through a Bermuda sod to get a food plot out. We have a wide range of test data from food plots we've worked with if anyone needs to know that or is interested. For the backyard person, I didn't spend much time on, but the Terra Tiller would be a very good item for a beginner into the food plot business that's more economically minded. It breaks a very narrow band, so don't think of it in terms of 
breaking up a total food plot, but more in terms of breaking up a row to plant seeds in, whether it be sorghum, millet, corn, whatever you might be choosing there, do it in rows or in bands. The idea of this is it's lower cost, it's easier to transport, put on one of the racks as you go in to where your food plot is. When you exit the ATV, the suspension lifts, you put it on the hitch in the back. When you set back down, you're actually compressing and causing soil contact. So it's more maneuverable, smaller, agile, easy to get around with. Uh, several other items you can take your time to go through. Hitches, wire unrollers, still have some carts. The next item you come to in the catalog is actually our equine products. We are a proud sponsor of the 2010 World Equestrian Games going, being held in Lexington, Kentucky. Uh, Alltech, Tartar Farm and Ranch, John Deere, and Ariat are the four sponsors that are covering the arena and those exercises. You'll see, and when you open our catalog, our new stall, it has a shark wire top, it has a poly insert bottom, powder coated drop pin design on the sides for attachment. This series of product does require a lead time, has minimum two week lead time, can reach up to six weeks depending upon demand. This item also has a slide out stall divider. These items are made upon your ordering and that's why for the lead time we want to have the best service, best product when we get it, uh, when you place your order. As you go through you'll see the other dividers and you'll see the slide out option as well as our standard stalls that are available powder coat or galvanized and we've reintroduced wood kits for the 20 season year. One time before we had offered those we took them away and due to consumer demand we now offer wood kits for the different items pre-cut pre-banded, it's on a pallet, delivers right in. Again, at Tartar, the idea behind our whole program, we want to cover, handle the inventory so you don't have to. That's so why we have a $1,500 minimum for freight-free delivery, is so you can turn, you can keep your inventory rotated, and we can get those products to you when you have a special demand with one of your customers. You have another order coming up in the next two to three weeks, so you can put it right with any standard products you might need fill that order quickly and efficiently and get that product in for that special order. Product, many products have not changed as you go through the equine section. The next item we're going to come to is going to be our continuous fence. Pipe fence has its own niche markets throughout the U.S. and it doesn't matter where you are, there's still customers there. Ours is a 2 inch 16 gauge. It's a special order, um, meaning that it's not in stock. It's available anytime upon ordering. We also have introduced a horse stock, which will help everyone uh, fulfill their needs from their equine business from Tartar. We also have our equine hay basket. This is a year by year, never ending, top demand from the internet list. It, it supports small square bales, um, natural feeding position, it is easier to fill than a manger type application. We now are able to offer that in a flat back fence line application as well as in a quarter or a corner section. That way for a run out behind the stall is very applicable and easily, easily fed and used. Um, product remain the same until you reach uh, all the way over. Go through the goat. The goat products are pretty much the same for this year, not introduced anything new going to come to a new section for Tartar. We have worked in this product for a year before introducing it in the catalog, and that is our utility trailers. Utility trailer market is highly competitive. Tartar wanted to ask how can we fit into it. We have the manufacturing skills, we have the knowledge. We chose that we can bring product, mix it as well as possible, especially if it's at two or three uh, trailer intervals, we can blend it in with our other stops and get it to you. You can also blend any other product in addition to those two trailers and bring it all in one stop right in, trying to offer more product to more locations to better service you. And that also works along with the $1,500 minimum. Exactly right. That $1,500 is mixed and matched across anything we manufacture. So a person can get into the, into the utility trailer business nice and easy. And it all it comes from how you manage your retail location, how you look at your margins and adjust them, 
Do you want a lot of inventory out there so you can make a healthy margin per sale and keep that on your books for a long time? Or do you want to keep the inventory smaller, shorten it up as necessary to be competitive, and rotate right on through your inventory and keep it fresh, clean, and new? That product has been out on the field for one year and it done very well. We're now introducing the roping product, rodeo end of our product line. It's product that we have had the capability and have built on demand and for bids for several years now. But we have finally felt comfortable in offering it as a full line section of our catalog. David Key is our national spokesperson and he is, you can find more information on our website about he. That's tartergate.com or tartarfarmingranch.com. David holds a roping clinic for uh, future stars every year and uses these products. We have a wonderful design, a very modern design in roping shoots. If you have any clients that might need that, you can go into further details. But such things as a rear tailgate that's linked to closing the head gate, 12 volt solar powered uh, charging system to release the head gate, onboard air storage. It's all small but modernizing new approaches. New line of panels, square cornered arena sides. We can accommodate anything from an economy based economical budget arena just for riding all the way up to a rougher seven event full line um, facility. Full line walkthroughs, heavy use panels, whether it's bulls, broncs, or just somebody going behind their cattle system. We also have an arena worker available with or without a water kit. That is, um, that's an item located on page 54. Should help in many fairgrounds or private arenas throughout the country. These products are all manufactured at Tartar Industries, our plant in Liberty, Kentucky, which is about 15 miles north of our office. We have a grown into a large supplier of many different OE companies. Our rotary tillers has been a big hit this year and it goes through, it's American made, we're proud to say it's powder coated, that's something a lot of companies can't offer. Source components, you're always going to run out of uh, domestic suppliers. But this is made in Kentucky, it's available year round, you don't have to worry about running out of inventory, you can pull those in as needed at any point in time. Our implement line has developed into offering heavy, um, heavier gearbox units on rotary cutters, offering heavier box blades and greater blades, different sizes, as well as a few new items here and there. Rotary cutters are still a huge hit for us, but fastly being overtaken by the rotary tillers. Finish mower is in shipping status. So anyone that has any needs or begins looking towards 2011 for what they want to carry in the spring, we have prime time to consider that. The items that we already have, as well as the new items, we have made those quick hitch friendly. And for 2010, we began offering a category one quick hitch. It's another add on sale to assist with your customer's demands or a want item that you can facilitate them with. So many of those new items you'll need to uh, go to the website and look at some new ones before you come down to the show and if you have any questions don't be afraid to stop by it's not the same old tartar gate anymore they've added many new items and uh, once again what's that website tartargate.com for those that are familiar with our original name or tartar farm and ranch for everyone uh, that are current and new users I'm glad you mentioned that because that's actually a marketing idea. We wanted to drop the gate because we are much more than gates. It's still a precious part of our business and we're glad to have all gate customers and want to continue that. But we want everyone to realize we're much more than just a gate company. Now there's, it doesn't matter if you're uh, strictly a, uh, a farm store, a lawn and garden store, there seems to be a little bit of something in there for you, whether it's rotary mowers, it's uh, food plot equipment. Stop by the website, take a look. Come on down to the show, and they can take care of you. Remember, out with the blue, in with the new, working harder since 1945.